The subscription business model is all about efficiently finding new recurring revenue while maximizing retention. And we know the companies that are successful in doing this are rewarded with higher valuations and multiples in the marketplace. But the CFOs of those companies all face similar challenges in achieving this. First, the KPIs that govern a subscription business are fundamentally different from the KPIs of a traditional business and they're much more sophisticated. So we see companies cobbling together spreadsheets from their CRM, their ERP, their data warehouse, and all the while really struggling to deliver results that are both robust and timely. Second, those KPIs are ultimately governed by subscriber behaviors and preferences. And that data often lives in a completely separate silo or may not be even captured at all meaning that it becomes very difficult to understand the things that are actually driving those business KPIs. And we know the subscription economy is evolving. So simply measuring churn is, for instance, no longer really sufficient. The highest performing companies in our space are looking at leading indicators that help them detect churn before it even happens. So this is the progression that we see many leading subscription companies going through. First, you nail the basics bulletproof KPIs that are ready for your board and for your investors. Second, you combine that with customer behavior data like product usage so that you really understand what's driving growth. Third and finally, you generate things like churn probability score, engagement health scores that help you really understand what's about to happen and predict it so that you can take action on it in advance. And that is why we built Insights to allow every Zora customer to go from end to end through this entire journey. With Insights, we take all of the transactional data that exists in Zora, your subscriptions, your billing, your payments, and we convert that into the powerful KPIs that you use to run your business, like churn and net retention and lifetime value. Since all of that data is coming from Zora, which handles your billing and not your CRM or a data warehouse, it really ends up being quite robust. You can intuitively explore any of these metrics to understand quickly what's driving them. Slicing a metric to just look at certain product groups, for instance. You can also save your changes, customizing KPIs to meet your specific needs. Next, Insights has a variety of connectors and APIs to ingest product usage data so that we can correlate subscriber behaviors with those financial outcomes and truly understand the patterns that lead to growth and retention. Lastly, our predictive algorithms go to work on all of your historical data to create scores like churn probability or conversion probability that are assigned to every customer account. B2C companies like the Enthusiast Network use insights to target marketing campaigns at particular segments of customers based on their churn probability, and they use that to reduce their overall churn rate. B2B companies like Broadly use insights to power their board metrics, while also changing the way that they sell and structure deals to reflect the deeper understanding that they gain of what really drives churn in their customer base. So if you're a CFO or a business leader in a subscription company, we highly encourage you to check out Insights.